for the last couple years, there's been an incredible shortage of workforce in the construction industry. General contractors, subs, builders have had a tough time finding skilled tradespeople that can work on projects, whether it's sheetrock, framing, excavation work, roofing. There's been a shortage and that's caused a delay in building and also an increased cost. Even builders who wanted to pay very high salaries couldn't find anybody. And this is because there was, first of all, a reduction in workforce, but also a huge jump in the number of construction projects. Well, now that interest rates have gone up and house prices have jumped to where nobody's really wanted to build, there's starting to be a little bit of a glut in the system. So drop a comment below. Let us know if you are a tradesperson, if, it's, uh, if, there's, if there's more demand for your work, or if there's more jobs available now because maybe nobody's looking for these types of workers. According to this article in Oregon, and this may exist in other states as well, um, the recession that's starting to bubble up is starting to have a domino effect in the construction industry where there's a loss of jobs. This is unheard of a couple years ago. Anybody who wanted a job could get one easily. The question now is, are there more workers than there are jobs? Are you a contractor or a construction company that's looking for workers right now and are maybe finding it easier to locate and onboard people? Or are you a worker right now that maybe there's fewer jobs around and there's more competition for those jobs. It seems like there's still a high demand, but according to this article and a couple other uh, references, there may be a little bit of a shift in the marketplace, even builders who wanted to pay big money. We had builders that were offering $80, $90 an hour for construction uh, experts, and there was no takers for framing, uh, for skilled things like drywall or paint and they couldn't find anybody even at those high rates.